नमस्कार दिस इज फर्स्ट पोस्ट एंड यू वॉचिंग वैंटेज विद मी पलकी शर्मा Prime Minister Modi has landed in France. The schedule is packed. The agenda is set. He'll be the chief guest at the Bastille Day Parade tomorrow. India is trying to take the UPI to France. We'll bring you the events, the highlights, and the analysis. Also discuss the uncomfortable but predictable pattern that such visits have fallen into. They roll out the red carpet on one side and begin sermons on human rights on the other. Last month. It was former president of the US Barack Obama this time it's the European Parliament they debated the violence in Manipur they targeted the government of India and its prime minister we'll discuss what this means also why is the US president calling the Ukrainian president Vladimir what is an internet apocalypse how did the Taliban become arms dealers and how bad are the floods in Delhi plus a special report on fast fashion France is spending millions of dollars to encourage people to mend their clothes instead of buying new the headlines first Russia strikes back at Ukraine after the NATO summit Kiev claims Moscow launched Iranian made Shahid drones targeting its capital Ukraine says it has destroyed 20 drones and two cruise missiles overnight Violence continues in Kenya as well at least 7 people have been killed and more than 300 arrested in clashes between police and protesters The William Ruto government has banned protests led by the opposition over tax hikes The clashes follow protest rallies in several cities last week Tensions spike in the restive Nagorno-Karabakh region. Armenia accuses Az Azerbaijan of an illegal blockade in this region. Armenia's prime minister seeks global help while announcing fresh peace talks with Baku. British healthcare in crisis once again. Junior doctors in the UK on a 5-day strike over pay. It's the biggest one in the history of the state-funded National Health Service or NHS. Senior hospital doctors in the country will also go on a 2-day strike next week. And Elon Musk launches his artificial intelligence company called XAI. With this, Musk hopes to compete with OpenAI, the creator of ChatGPT. He says the goal of XAI is to quote unquote understand the true nature of the universe.